about the uh, the semen, about the sperm, right? Mm -hmm. Well, in the Quran, chapter uh, eighty-six, verse number six and seven, Muhammad he claimed that women they have semen. Do you believe that women have semen? <laughs> Okay, how Muhammad, uh, I don't know if I can only call him now Muhammad or Dr. Muhammad. How Dr. Muhammad now, he discovered that women have semen. This is Ibn Kathir, I will put it on the screen. And this is not my interpretation, so Muslim will not say to you, Christian Prince is lying to you, it doesn't say that, it doesn't mean that. So this is Ibn Kathir, here he says, uh, let, so let the man see from what he is created. This is alerting man on weakness of his origin, which was created. Then he continues saying, He is created from water gushing forth, meaning the sexual fluid that come rusting forth from the man and the women. So there's a water come out of the women, not stay inside the women, and there's a water come out of the man, not stay inside the man, brust him forth, and that thus the child is produced from both of them. Wonderful. So Muhammad, uh, so the Quran claimed that the women she produce water, the man he produce water, and the water is what make babies. Let us see what, what, that, what does that mean, more details meaning the backbone of the man and the ribs of the women, which referring to her chest. And here they are giving you a hadith. From Muhammad he says, the backbone of the man and the ribs of the women, are, it is the fluid, yellow and fine in texture, and the child will not be born except from both of them, i.e. their sexual fluid. What do you think, my sister? Is that what God really inform us did you learn in school that women have a semen yeah. it's obvious right it's obvious that this is false women don't have semen Muhammad is being foolish. He thought that the women, the liquid, the women she have in her private part during sexual intercourse, and in a funny way he described it as yellow, which means the women he Muhammad he been with, they have a sexual disease, because why it's why, why it's yellow? They, they, they will it's going to be yellow only if they have certain STD disease. So Muhammad he think that women sexual fluid, which is yellow, and man which is sexual fluid, which is white, is the reason to make a baby. When they mix together, we have a baby. And actually, we find that in the hadith. Here we go, Muhammad, he mentioned that. If we go to the hadith, we will find it in details. A woman, she came to Muhammad, she asked him that she saw a wet dream. Obviously, she is masturbating. Excuse my language. So, uh, So she told Muhammad if she need to wash her private part. So Muhammad, he said, well, if you see a liquid there, you have to wash it. Uh, the wife of Muhammad, she was listening. And she said to Muhammad, does women even have this charge? Which means the wives of Muhammad never have orgasm. Otherwise, why the wife of Muhammad? She is so surprised to hear that this woman, she have this charge. And now Muhammad is telling her that she have to wash it. But Muhammad, he claimed now in this hadith, this is why we are mentioning it, that the women discharge is how the baby is made. What Muhammad, he said after his wife, Umm Salama said, Umm Salama smiled, she said, does a woman get discharged? Allah Apostle said, then why does the child resemble the mother? <laughs> What does this have to do with resembling the, the mother? You know, the, the women have this charge that how the baby is made. The discharge 
is the water coming out. This is not the egg. It's a water. In other hadith, Muhammad he explained it even more. He make it clear that this is about water. Here it says, if she see the water, you see in Arabic, you said that you are from an Arab family. It says here, إِذَا رَأَتِ الْمَا Do you see the word ma? إِذَا رَأَتِ الْمَا If she saw the water, so you don't see something is inside the body, right? You see what is outside the body, correct? Mm -hmm. So إِذَا رَأَتِ الْمَا If she saw the women, then this is the discharge, and then she have to wash it. And then Umm Salama, she said, well, do the women even have really the discharge? Muhammad, he says, okay, how the, how, you know, he's saying his wife, you are silly, stupid, you know, don't you know? So then how the baby resemble his uh, parents or the mother, you know? What do you think? This is a, a prophet. This is Muhammad. Dr. Muhammad showing a big failure and ignorance in what he is talking about, yet he claimed that he received his knowledge from God. But this is cannot be from God. This is a man making things up. The discharge of the women have nothing to do how the baby look like. As you see, Umm Salama, she never had this charge, the wife of Muhammad. She never had it. So if a woman, she never have this charge, especially many Muslim women, they do circumcision for them, which means they will never have orgasm. That means the baby, they cannot, the woman didn't, cannot have a baby. Because women, they don't have this charge. They never have orgasm. 